Hey, boys and girls, ladies and gentlemen. Well, it's time for me to continue my run of uh, Zelda. Yup, haven't been updating much today because I was busy picking my nose, watching TV, going out with friends, doing stuff like that. Ah, oh, darn Zolas or Zoras or whatever people prefer to call them. Most fans prefer to call those little spinning guys Zolas because, uh, when people when fans think of Zoras now, they think of those friendly guys and uh, and uh, Ocarina of Time. They ha they happen to be my favorite race. If I was any uh, uh, race in Zelda, it would have to be a Zora. They're just too cool. And a lot of fangirls think they're, for some reason, attractive. I guess, uh, some girls like fish people. I don't think many of them find, uh, the kings are attractive. They're freaking fat. Heh, <laughs> I'm fat. But, uh, no offense, fat people. I am one of you. So it's okay. Just like someone who's, uh, Skin color is different than Dog the Bounty Hunter. It's more appropriate for them to say the N-word. Topical humor. Okay, gotta get the key to the fish shrine, and it's easy to get to. Quite easy. Wait, uh, hold on. Don't I need my arrows for this? I think I do. Oh, man, I love this color thing. It... Uh, adding color to games sometimes helps because sprites were designed in a different w way uh, when programming. So when you play the, back these old games, certain things kind of give you hints when you play it on Game Boy Color. For instance, you can tell that these ones, that the ones that come to life when you touch them are the... Are the... What do you call them? The... Kind of lavender periwinkle colored ones? Well, the red ones are stiff. Oh yeah, that's not going to be very useful, I don't think. Eh, your face will die. I love this music. So dramatic. Because the truth is going to be revealed in here. About this game. How do you fight this guy again? It's been a while. Wait, I think it's, uh... Arrows, like the regular ones. Oops. This guy's pretty easy. Oops. See, that was freaking easy. See, getting the face key was that easy. <laughs> Down this place. This place Barry Clance is a dungeon. It's more of a warm-up thing to give you the atmosphere of the next dungeon. To the finder, the Isle of Coheland is but an illusion. Human monster, sea, sky, a scene of the lid of a sleeper's eye. Awake the dreamer, and Coheland will vanish much like a bubble on a needle. Cast away, you should know the truth. What? Illusion? Hey, is that Link talking to himself? Everyone credits uh, Wind Waker for the first time he actually said anything, and it was just, come on. And again, he said it in, uh... Uh, Adventure of Link, like Zelda 2, he did say, I found a mirror under the table. Hoot, I see that you have read a... Oh, whatever. I know, thanks for giving away the ending before it's the end. We've all figured out it's just a dream. But this game is... That Link's not really adventuring, it's just his subconscious. 
Look at those statues. Don't they freak you out? It's like hands coming out of their under their eyelids with bloody fingertips. Man, Link, your mind is messed up. There's no uh, naked women or women running around in this world, so I assume Link's a, a very clean thinker. I can admire that. Guardian Acorn. Oh, I see. I can knock him away with the sword. That was pointless. Dead end. Freaking blob bunch. I asked for that. You know those piece of power and the guardian acorns? How come we never saw them again? I think I know how to get there. I mean, they were uh, really cool in this, but they never appeared in a later Zelda. Go away. Flying mushroom butt. Well, that was stupid. Wrong button. Don't attack those. You'll get electrocuted. If Zelda games have taught me anything, is deep down, everything wants to kill you. Almost there, almost to the face shrine. No meager fetch quests for us. That barely that quick run barely counted a fetch quest. Barely counted as one, it was pretty easy. That boss just there wasn't hard at all. This dungeon has one of the most useless treasures in the game. A level 2 bracelet. And the what, guess what the only real use for those level 2 bracelets are? To lift up statues in this one dungeon. I can't think of any object besides those statues in this one dungeon that have that have use for it. Oh great, these, these guys. Everyone hated them in the original Zelda and they're back. Ah. Die. Your father ticked me off, stupid... Wormhead. Shy guys! See these? Look at that nose. There's. <laughs> it's freaky. This is getting past the point of the, the game I've played a lot. This is getting into the late part of the game, and uh. I've gotta jar my memory because it's, it's a bit foggy. I can see its body. Aha! Oh well, I'm going to do the rest later. Hurrah.